2v2 team racing, a discipline within the sport of sailing, where it's not every boat for themselves. You have a teammate on the race course, and you're racing a set of other boats trying to do the same thing as you, not have one of your teammates finish last. The Chesapeake Bay Yacht Racing Association has been providing grants to Matra, Maryland area team racing addicts, for three years now, which has helped kindle the interest fuel the learning process, and create large networks amongst the Maryland sailing community and beyond. Together with Gibson Island Yacht Squadron's facilities and fleet of sonars, the boats commonly used for this kind of competition, the goal of getting people on the water, learning together, regardless of background or club affiliation, is being reached. The first test of our abilities for 2023 came in the form of the New York Yacht Club Women's 2v2 in Newport, Rhode Island. Eight women on the CBYRA team hit the water thanks to the nearly all-female sailing office, organizing, and race committee, and umpires in challenging conditions to say the least. The first day's puffs were blowing well into the 30s. All other racing was canceled in Newport that weekend, except for us. The New York Yacht Club's fleet of sonars with quantum sails held up in battle for the start of the round robin and Team CBYRA came out strong, only losing the first race of the day. The disciplines of match racing and team racing are so fun. I love fleet racing and sailing fast, but I love a reason to go slow and engage with another boat. It lets me uh, release that inner tiger that I feel like I can't do in real life. So it frees me and I feel uh, my best self when I get out on the water and I get to team race and match race against other people. CBYRA support has created a pathway for women on the Chesapeake Bay to race at the highest level, um, not only in 2v2s, but in match racing and 3v3 team racing. We, it, we wouldn't be able to do as well as we've done without CBYRA support. race days, the team had many talks on land about tactics and strategy and enjoyed the dinner event from our lovely hosts, and then took on day two in only slightly less breeze, again losing only our first race, which put our record for the round robin, the only racing of the regatta, at seven and two, which we soon found out was a record shared by not only one, but three other teams. A lot of math was sorted out by the umpires on shore to determine that Team CBYRA came out in second place out of the 10 teams from across the country. Racing in this regatta, for me personally, it gives me the chance to do team racing, which unfortunately there's not a lot of opportunities. It's just so much fun. It brings me so much joy in the sport of sailing. It's so fun. It's fast paced. It's athletic. It's coordination. It's teamwork. It checks all the boxes. Races are quick. It's just so fun uh, to be in that engaged sport and engaged activity all day. The time passes so quickly. It's just such a fun way to sail. It was incredibly close competition on the water, and we were glad to be doing what we loved, competing at the highest level with so many talented sailors, using our minds and hands to achieve not only a successful result, but meet more like-minded people, expand our minds and experiences, continue teammate relationships, and to make us even hungrier for that top of the podium.